a child sometimes 17 you know that you think so whatever i'm fine as long as we can make a stop in town my clothes are a mess i think i'm going to need a new outfit sure why not <laughs> hey wait wait huh what do you want what is it that you guys are after i mean why are you doing this well first we're gonna take care of goku I mean, why are you going after Goku? Hey, this is all just a game. I mean, Goku's the strongest guy around. Am I right? You probably won't just stop because I asked you to, right? Negative. We were created for the sole purpose of eliminating Goku. You heard the big guy. Yeah. Yeah, man. But shouldn't you be helping his master instead of talking to us? They're gonna die. <laughs> See ya. Bye. I gotta help the others. So they knew all about the sensu beans and just let us go on our way. They didn't even feel the need to kill us. It's a little rude, don't lie. Don't go after him. Just leave him be. He'd finally become a super saiyan and regained his pride and confidence as a warrior. Getting beaten that badly was probably too much for him to take. Even Trunks, who defeated Frieza so easily, couldn't lay a finger on them. That's it, isn't it? No matter how strong Goku gets, there's no way we can win. Okay, here's the plan. You guys go to Goku's house, then move him to a different location immediately. Before we do anything else, we need to make sure Goku gets better. Uh, Probably so, a solid plan. Uh, right. What are you gonna do, Piccolo? <laughs> I'm gonna have an Namekian three soon. What's gotten into Piccolo all of a sudden? Piccolo's gonna get two Namex inside him. Okay, I think I get it. He's got one final trick up his sleeve. One final trick? What do you mean? So you know what's in that direction, right? Huh? I'm not really sure. What are you trying to say? That's Kami's place. And what does that have to do with anything? When I was back on planet Namek, I spoke to Guru. He told me that if Kami and Piccolo hadn't separated, they'd be as powerful as a Saiyan. So, I'm betting that Piccolo's gonna combine with Kami and go back to being his true warrior self. But wait, if Kami ceases to exist as he is now, won't the Dragon Balls disappear too? Mm. Uh, Not really. But if either of them dies separately, well, then the same thing's gonna happen anyway, so... Piccolo probably feels like this is our best shot at taking down an enemy this powerful. But what about my fa- I, I mean, what about Vegeta? What do you think he's up to? Relax, there's no need the to hide it anymore. I mean, we already know that you're Bulma's kid, 
all grown up and from the future. Vegeta's the only one who doesn't know. What? Uh, oh, uh, I see. I'm sorry for hiding it from you. Hey, no need to apologize. Exposition. I'm going to meet up with Chaozu. If things get hairy again, I'll be back. Gotcha. We're gonna get Goku and take him to Master Roshi's place, okay? Okay. Make sure you tell Goku not to overdo it. Right. We'll tell him. You're staring right at me, lady. Trunks, let me introduce Goku's wife. This is Chi Chi. Huh? Who are you? I don't think I've seen you before. <laughs> hey, Chi Chi. Pleased to meet you. <laughs> Krillin, you're all right. Oh, I was worried sick about you guys. Oh, Yamcha. <clears throat> right, you're here. Are there any changes? He's fine. He took his medicine, and now he's sleeping. So you're the guy from the future, huh? Oh, yeah. You're the one that beat the androids, right? <sighs> no. Sorry, but we'll fill you in later. First, we need to move Goku to Master Roshi's place, and fast! What's going on? Two. Actually, three scary androids are on their way here, and they're after Goku! Oh, no, that's not good. <laughs> yeah, no shit, dude. Let's get him move on. Hi everyone. What are we doing here? Did did something happen? We'll tell you on the way. Just get in. Get in, loser. <clears throat> Meanwhile, they're just going to walk to Goku's apparently. Have any leads just yet? Do you have any idea where Goku is? Didn't you hear me before? It's more fun this way, taking our time and hunting him down. Regardless, we should still have some kind of game plan. Hey, 16, what about you? You know something, right? Goku's house that is, is your mission, right? the mountains in East District 439. So you did know something. You're just full of surprises. Did Dr. Giro tell you that? Well, programmed it in. If we fly, we should arrive in a matter of minutes. I know, right? See, this guy gets it. Traveling on foot is a complete waste of time when you're capable of flying. You're such a whiner. Right. It's gonna be more fun this way. <sighs> you know what? You can be a real pain in the neck, Seventeen. We're just about at Master Roshi's place. Hey, Krillin. Yeah? No seatbelts. Probably let Bulma in on everything that's happening, don't you think? Well, uh, bits and pieces. Yeah, you're right. So, what does that mean? I have to call her. Ah, oh, man. You know, your mom isn't exactly easy to talk to sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> She's the same in my time too. Nope, just gonna do it over the phone then, alright? Alright. It's, uh, it's Krillin. Krillin, you're alright? Why didn't you tell me before? Is my son, oh, my future son, there? Huh? Oh, uh, yeah. Why? What's up? Well, I heard from headquarters that we got a call a few days ago from someone out west in the countryside. Okay. They said they found a strange vehicle in the mountains that had Capsule Corporation written on the side of it. I got them to send me a photo, which I then tried to match with the database of our products to see who it might belong to. But it didn't match anything I could find. I thought Trunks might know something about it. 
Good call. My time machine. It's definitely the time machine I came here in. But how is that possible? I've got my time machine right here with my other capsules. I thought this might be a time machine, but what's it doing in a place like that? Do you know the exact location of the time machine? All right, good enough. You headed there? Yes, I'd like to see it for myself. Then I'm coming too. We can meet up near the machine's location. All right. I'd like to help you look for it too. Is that okay? Sure, buddy. Of course. Thank you. Go on. <clears throat> Don't worry, Mom. We're not going anywhere dangerous. We'll be safe. He's traveling with the Super Saiyan with the sword, too. So, you know, should be fine. Be sure to check out the Is That All podcast, where Kevin and I take existing movie plots, and we rewrite the movies without ever knowing what the title is. Is it good? Is it bad? Is it better? Is it worse? In order to find out, you'll have to tune in to the Is That All podcast, available everywhere you can find podcasts.